In June 2012, attorney Corey Briggs stepped up and sued on behalf of the residents of the Sweetwater School District. The DA was saying millions of dollars in construction contracts were awarded in a corrupt way and Briggs said taxpayers should get the money back. He reached out to school district officials like Superintendent Ed Brand and board member Pearl Quinones and never heard back. Well, no wonder. Quinones and other officials were the very ones accused of granting the contracts in exchange for meals, play tickets, and other considerations. They handed out the money and went to the groundbreaking ceremonies. Well, two years later, four school board members have been ousted, and the district has finally joined Briggs in seeking $26 million back from the contractors. The companies say they only got paid for work they did, and it was all good work at that. But Briggs says the law is the law, and contracts granted under such conditions are invalid. A judge will take the matter up on August 8th. For The Watchdog, I'm Ricky Young, UTTV.